All right, guys, quick video. I'm talking about the Saturday tournament and my next coming um, events and what I got planned for 2023 since 2022 is over. Um, the season has ended for 2022. No more tournaments for this year. Next year, um, the first tournament that I'm eyeballing is the LA UAL tournament. That one is going to be off the chain. That one's going to be crazy. So I'm trying to get prepared for that one. Today is Thursday night practice. So I'm going to go to practice. Um, I went to my therapy today. So just on recovery right now, full recovery mode. And just uh, train, train, train hard. I got about a month. If I do um, make it to that tournament, hopefully, fingers crossed. And an Eric Wolf super match next year, 2023. Me and Eric. That's right. That's happening. Um, be on the lookout for that. Um, and the tournament this Saturday, man, what can I say? It was such a great tournament. I'm glad I went. Um, you know, I go to all the West Texas Arm Sports tournaments because they're just awesome. Uh, chance for 300 bucks. I was there, but Nate did like Debo and he just snatched that money and took off. Um, shout out to Nate McCallum, real strong dude. Um, I want to see him um, hit up some tournaments and um, pull some top level dudes in the North America. That would be awesome. And um, what else? What else? Yeah, so basically, um, I got first place. I got first place um, in my weight class, 230. I got right hand and I got left hand. So lefty came through today for me. Um, it did take a loss, though, to Edgar Barrios, man. Shout out to uh, Edgar. You were feeling awesome. Um, I train with him. We're training partners, and I know he's freaky strong. Um, you already know a tournament's different though. Um, but he did real good. He had a real nice hit in the tournament. I was able to, you know, get him though. I had to get him twice, left handed, right handed. He couldn't stop me. Nobody really stopped me right handed. So, um, luckily, I guess that meant that uh, my right arm was pretty healed up from the Edo match. But uh, I'm still a little bit sore. I'm on recovery mode right now, like I said. And uh, yeah, just waiting for the next next uh possible chance to arm wrestle so be on the lookout and my west uh i mean in the either the west texas arm sports page okay we're gonna post like everything all the official uh tournaments and practices stuff like that but also like and subscribe my channel because i might have some projects coming up soon that are gonna be pretty interesting all right so like and subscribe comment that means the world to me guys you already know uh my rat tail is on a hot streak though so this one it's all messy my girlfriend can't wait to redo it um but i don't i don't let her i haven't let her redo it because i'm like it's on a hot streak she did it right before colorado and um i've been winning i've been winning with this exact rat tail so i redo it maybe every like two weeks or a month now i i probably have like over maybe uh, close to two months with this rat tail so yeah i gotta do it it's a rat's nest up there but the meaning behind it is basically if you guys have seen star wars you know that the padawans have the rat tails and it's basically means that they're in training to become a master so put it together i'm trying <laughs> i'm trying to become a master at my craft I'm just gonna keep on going um and yeah I, I gotta redo this so maybe i might do a video on how it's done it's just pretty simple but yeah if you guys want to see that um but yeah guys have a great rest of your thursday thank you for supporting thank you for watching and we're gonna keep coming at you live baby west texas arm sports freddie sanchez arm wrestling have a great day